Hello and welcome back to the 2014 Sochi Olympic Games. I'm Guy Kensington and with me as always, Chip Matthews. I'm Chip Matthews. That's Chip with a C Matthews. We've had a fantastic game so far so in Sochi. So many dogs. Let's get right to the medal count. As you can see from the leaderboard, Norway is on top with a dominant performance in the cross-country events. Norway. More like Borway. And while Norway has owned the flats, Canada has dominated the slopes, claiming seven medals in snowboarding and freestyle skiing alone. Canada. Hate the people. Love the syrup. On to the U.S. Ah, my hometown. For the first time in Olympic history, the U.S. men have failed to medal in the snowboarding half pipe. Which I, for one, think is horse Two-time Olympic champion Sean White failed to get to the podium. iPod the Swissman takes home the gold after landing a 1440-degree whirling jump nicknamed the YOLO jump. And for those of you at home who don't know, YOLO is a children's toy from the 20th century, using a string to defy the laws of gravity. Chip, your countrymen also had their first ever medal in women's luge. Aaron Hamlin won the bronze. Aaron, is that a guy or a gal? Uh, again, it was a bronze in the women's luge. Uh, you just, you just never know with some of these names. Russia continues a strong showing coming off a gold medal win in team figure skating. That's Russia's first gold medal. Uh-oh. Spoiler alert. The games are in Russia. Coincidence. Ladies and gentlemen, that's your medal count update for day four. Stay with us here at SB Nation. I'm Guy Kensington with my partner. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There is no male partner in Sochi. Uh, that's, that's broadcast partners there, Boris. Keep it that way. Remember, here at SB Nation, we're the only nation winning all the gold. Cheerio!